So my high pressure electric fuel pump was making a whining noise and I thought well maybe that has to do with this uh, fuel filter being clogged because that can make the uh, pressure drop through the fuel filter being too high then the fuel pump will cavitate and make a whining noise and fortunately although I'm old I can still hear into very high ranges very clearly so uh, I, I heard the whining noise where other old people might not hear it. Uh, so anyway swapping out the fuel filter did get rid of the high pitch whine so this much must be the culprit so I decided to rip this apart and see what it's actually made out of and you can see the filter isn't really all that big compared to the uh, size of the container and when I took this apart uh, well before I took it apart there, there was some glop that came out of it you know big pieces of glop but no, not all that much and then I decided well let's actually saw it apart and see what's going on and I started out with a hacksaw that didn't work it was too slow so this filter isn't obviously horrifying but you know uh, if there's a whole lot of little particles cl clogging up all the little 10 micron holes or whatever it is uh, you might not see those particles and the filter would be clogged So the hacksaw was in fact useful in chopping this paper filter off and you can see how this uh, the filter actually works. The fuel flows in through these outer holes and then uh, in this gap here and then it flows through the paper and then through this barrel and then back out the threaded hole in the middle there and this barrel supports the paper uh, from the high pressure that's trying to push the paper inward. So that's how the whole thing works. So you can see the paper is fairly dark on the outside where the fuel flows in. And then uh, it comes out the other side and you can see that side of the paper is still pretty clean. So you know this, this doesn't look really all that bad but you know what do I know? I was concerned there might be a bunch of construction debris like often happens in uh, boat fuel tanks but this one you know it, it looks not so bad you know, so they did actually vacuum it out probably um, so anyway there's there is some dirt here clearly you know it's hard to say where it came from maybe a little bit from manufacturing maybe from this or that uh, gas station uh, who knows uh, it's uh, pretty difficult to point the finger at the correct place and you know maybe this really isn't all that dirty anyway. So if you have an opinion, an informed opinion in particular about whether or not this is super dirty, uh, maybe you could uh, chime in in the comments and uh, let everybody know what you think.